Hey guys, what's going on? James here, and in this video today, we're going to be talking about, yet again, another interesting quote that Bruce Arians gave recently. This was on March 30th. Again, I know I'm pretty darn late to these quotes, but I still wanted to give my thoughts on it. Um, this information is, yet again, from PewterReport.com, specifically an article written by Taylor Jenkins. Thank you, my bro. But with that being said, let's get into this quote, and it talks about... Keyshawn Vaughn. Now, Bruce Arians was asked about how the roles for the Tampa Bay Buccaneers running back position is going to, you know, sift out, filter out, basically. How it's going to shape up, I guess you could say. This was after the re-signing of Leonard Fournette, and this is what Bruce Arians had to say. That all can be defined through practice and OTAs and training camp and preseason. Uh, those guys are all here and know what the system is, and the best players are going to play. Obviously, we have two really, really good ones at that position, and I really like Keyshawn Vaughn. I think that with an offseason, he's going to have a breakout year also. All of those roles will be defined by the time that we get to the last week of the preseason. Now, there were more quotes that Bruce Arians had gave in regards to the running back position. Uh, he essentially said they're not ruling out drafting a running back depending on, you know, positional values and whether or not they like a running back more than a cornerback or a defensive end and all these other different types of things. So the Buccaneers are still not ruling out drafting a running back, but that was really interesting. Bruce Arians had said, look, we have two really, really good running backs, presumably talking about Ronald Jones and Leonard Fournette, but he really likes Keyshawn Vaughn, and he specifically said he expects Keyshawn Vaughn to have a breakout year, which, whoa, that is quite an endorsement from Bruce Arians, in my opinion. Uh, there was a lot of people who were critical of the Keyshawn Vaughn pick when it was made, you know, and then it didn't get better after the signing of Leonard Fournette. Um, things just didn't work out for Keyshawn Vaughn in his rookie season. I mean, he was inactive for a handful of games, didn't get a ton of playing time. He had fans. I mean, he does have fans, I guess I should say. Um, and he definitely made a little bit of a name for himself when he caught a touchdown pass from Tom Brady. That got people a little bit excited, but then that kind of died down a little bit as he just continued to not get much playing time. And, um, a lot of people are now kind of like, Oh yeah, I guess Keyshawn Vaughn's there, you know? But now with this endorsement of Bruce Arians, I mean, what what could this mean? Um, Keyshawn Vaughn, third round draft pick in this most recent NFL draft. He's going to be competing with Ronald Jones, a former second round draft pick of the Bucks in his own right. And then Leonard Fournette, who's a former top 10 pick. I mean, all three of these running backs have their own groups of fans who are supporting them and really want them to get a lot of playing time. Uh, myself, personally, I mean, you know, I'm, I, I guess I'm rooting for all three guys. I, I normally lean more towards Ronald Jones being the starter, and I still do, but this is going to be really interesting. And I had talked about this in the Leonard Fournette video, where now that he is re-signed, this is going to be one heck of a fight to see who is going to get snaps at this running back position. And now that Bruce Arians has given an endorsement to Keyshawn Vaughn, it's just gotten even more interesting. I mean, people were already talking about, oh man, Ronald Jones versus Leonard Fournette, what's going to happen with that? But now you can throw Keyshawn Vaughn's name into that mix as well. He didn't really have that you know, great of a situation in his rookie year with the illness and all these other different types of things really preventing him from getting the experience that he needed in his rookie year. And that's what led Bruce Arians to say, hey man, when he gets a full off season of work under his belt, might have a breakout year. I mean, there's a reason the Buccaneers drafted Keyshawn Vaughn in the third round. They have faith in him and his abilities as a running back. Um, and now that he'll be able to get more experience than he got in his rookie year, that can only help. So, yeah, this just got even more interesting. Another wrinkle added to this running back mix right now. And Bruce Arians even said that they haven't even ruled out drafting a running back. So then add another wrinkle into that running back room mix. Th this is going to be one heck of an interesting position group battle. Probably one of the most important ones to pay attention to for this the remainder of this offseason and for the remainder of the preseason as well. I'm going to be very excited to see how this all shapes up. I'm definitely intrigued by Keyshawn Vaughn. I'm sure a lot of you guys are as well. And um, I'm obviously a big Ronald Jones guy. I love playoff Lenny and I want Keyshawn Vaughn to exceed as well. Um, but you can only give the ball so many times to so many people. So... You know, who's going to prevail? Who's going to go ahead and get those snaps, get those touches? We'll have to wait and see. Bruce Arians seems like Keyshawn Vaughn is going to have a breakout year. Will he? Who knows? But 
BA's got confidence in him. So that is definitely worth something. Let's pay attention to this. But anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Give me your thoughts about Keyshawn Vaughn down in the comments section below. Do you think he'll have a breakout year? Uh, man, personally, I think it's it it's possible, but it's going to be pretty tough given the circumstances right now with all the talent the Buccaneers have in that running back room with Ronald Jones and Leonard Fournette, but you never know. We'll see. Maybe Keyshawn Vaughn could carve out a role for himself in a receiving back type capacity and um, get his touches that way. But anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Hope you all enjoyed, and I will see you all in the next video or the next live stream. But until then, and as always, guys, goodbye for now, and go Bucks.